come to the northernmost coast of Scotland, to Findhorn, which is the largest and longest running eco village in the UK. We've come specifically to visit Jonathan Dawson, who's the president of the Global Eco Village Network. My name is Angus. I uh, I kind of rocked up here just to have a little look, and then ended up finding a lovely place to stay just maybe 15 miles along the road. Uh, it's a nice little farm, an organic farm, and there's a small community of us there. Uh, and I kind of I like a lot of the things round about here, the sustainability, you know, the sort of the values of the people in the in, in the community. Originally I came to improve my English, to live in Scotland because I love this country and hiking in here and to live in an international community and I've worked as a gardener for many years here now so I've grown totally attached to the land and just it gives me deep joy in tending, looking after the land, working with the land, from the land. My name is May East, I am originally from Brazil. I've been living at the Finhorn Eco Village for the last 14 years and I hold two roles here. I'm the Director for International Relations. This means I take lots of what happens here to the world, particularly to the United Nations, because we have an associative status to the UN. And I also work with Education for Sustainability. Uh, training people to do the transition from uh, non-sustainable lifestyles to sustainable lifestyles. We started here exactly where we are, you know, uh, with that caravan there. Because we didn't own the land for many, many years, we just could have caravans and also the bungalows. They are not permanent residents. And s slowly, when we bought the land, we started to substitute the caravans. I choose to live at Findhorn because I love living amongst people who are all interested in engaging to the level I want to engage. So their ethics, their values are the same as mine and daily life for that reason is very intense, quite challenging at times, but I want to live that way. I don't want to live in some mindless um, sort of remote control sort of universe I want to be aware. When people come to me after seeing the village, my profile answer is it's invisible. Meaning that what really is much more about the the way we, we relate to ourselves, to each other, to the land, to the community. That is the heart of it really. The heart of the simple insight is to do with uh, with the design, with developing a culture that is with something